going to be reading from uh, Psalm 150 and verse 1. Praise ye the Lord, praise God in his sanctuary, praise him in the firmament of his power, praise him for his mighty acts, praise him according to his excellent greatness, praise him with the sound of the trumpet, praise him with the psaltery and harp, praise him with the tremble and the dance, praise him with stringed instruments and organs, praise him upon the loud cymbals, praise him upon the high sounding cymbals, let everything that is breath, praise the Lord, praise ye the Lord, just a wee word of prayer, Lord Jesus I thank you so much that with everything that's going on in the world Lord I thank you Lord we've got the assurance that we can come to you and we can praise your name, thank you Lord that you're in complete control, thank you that you are sovereign, and I just pray, Lord, you help me bring the word that I believe you've laid in my, uh, my heart uh, for the brothers and sisters. And I just pray uh, that we'll be able to bring you glory and praise tonight. For your name's sake, Lord Jesus. Amen. When I was praying to God for a word for tonight, I was, uh, I was just asking the Lord, saying, what Lord, what do you want me to say? And I felt the Lord laying in my heart to talk about praising the name of Jesus and praising God. A lot, uh, in, our, uh, in the world today, there's a lot of uncertainty going on. There's a lot of uh, stress. There's a lot of, kind of uh, the, the message is wait patiently for this, uh, for the, the lockdown to be lifted. And that's not a natural thing for people to, uh, people to uh, wait. But brothers and sisters, we've got a blessing tonight that we are born again Christians. We've got a lot to thank God for. We can, uh, we have got the assurance that God is with us. You know, I got a blessing the, the past, uh, the past week when we heard my brother Scott uh, praying and testifying that God's moved in his heart. God has been really moving in a beautiful way the past couple of weeks. We've, we've seen Alec and, Alec and uh, Selena uh, getting healed. We saw that, uh, we saw that, that picture posted by Linda of Wee Corner. And the Lord is answering my prayers. And I feel tonight that the Lord is just wanting us to you know, just praise him, just thank him for who he is. You know, it's quite, it's, it's quite easy to get caught up with everything that's going on. But it's... Uh, but it's a blessing to us, brothers and sisters, that we can serve the Lord and we can praise the name of Jesus. You know, the only way we are going to be truly effective in our prayers, or the only way we're going to be truly effective for the Lord is that we trust in the Lord. You know, I was there, uh, I was thinking of Paul and Silas, and when they were in the prison, they could have been sitting there freaking out, thinking, what's going on? What's going to happen? But they didn't do that. They praised the Lord. They, they, they sang and praised the Lord and God moved. So I pray that tonight, as we sit and we're thinking about everything that's going on in the world, that we would be able to say our God reigns. Our God is in complete control. You know, we've got amazing blessings. God has saved us. We're bound for glory. We've got Christ in us, the hope of glory. God is good. You know, over this past couple of, couple of days, I've been really quite ill. I've been uh, violently sick. Uh, I've not been able to eat. But the thing, that got, the, the thing that's got me through this is God is good. God, is with, uh, God has been with me through this whole thing. And I pray that tonight as we, uh, we come to prayer that God would really, uh, that God would speak to our hearts in a beautiful way. And that uh, the vision that we have for the future, I pray, uh, let, let's, let's approach this in bated breath and say to God, what have you got in store? As I say, God's answered our prayers for people like uh, Selena and for, uh, for Alec. And our prayer tonight is that God would move in a mighty way in this nation. This nation is lost, it's dark. It's, 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 the, the people who are unconverted, 
they've only got their own understanding. We've been blessed tonight that we can stand in the name of uh, stand in the name of Christ, and that we can pray that God will move in a mighty way, because God is the only remedy to this situation. So I pray that. Uh, so let, let, let's let's take this. Uh, let, let's approach the throne of grace, and let's claim this revival for God. Let's pray that God would move in mighty power. Amen. Lord Jesus, I thank you, Lord, that you're in complete control. I thank you, Lord, that we can praise your name. I thank you that you are sovereign. I thank you, Lord, that although I was stuttering and stammering, the message is that you're in control. I thank you, Lord, that you are you are God. Lord, you've saved us. You've predestinated us before the foundation of the world. And I just pray, Lord, that your glory be made known uh, in this nation, Lord, that we'd see a mighty revival for your glory and honour. For your name's sake, Lord Jesus. Amen.